Donuts here in downtown Austin because babes wants donuts. I am on vacation. She's officially on vacay, so she wants to buy some donuts, and we are right down the street, so might as well do it. Let's go. So it's bike week here in Austin, Texas, and it's pretty crazy in downtown. We are on 6th Street, and I never come here, but we're not fans of 6th Street. But babe wanted Pudu donuts and. It's on 6th Street. <laughs> Street. That is the only that is the only reason why we come down here. And uh, it's bike week, so there's a lot more people than usual. And uh, it's just craziness. Craziness, craziness. And right now it's still early, so we kind of dodged like 70% of the craziness that's going to be happening on tonight probably the rest of this weekend so yeah welcome to bike week what's up guys welcome once again to another video you know me I'm so Ricardo and I am your host this is not a show anyways a um, couple of things do you guys remember, you know, how we went to downtown Austin, like we were in downtown getting donuts for Sabrina? Well, yeah, that specific same night, <clears throat> that same night, there was a big, massive shooting in downtown Austin on 6th Street, pretty much three or four blocks away from where we were. Uh, I believe as of now, there's like two people that have actually died of injuries and about 16 people uh, got injured in this massive shooting yeah it's pretty scary to to have been there a couple of hours before all this happened as you know sabrina sabrina and i did go to downtown but it was pretty early it was uh probably like around i don't know probably like around six or seven o'clock uh on friday and this happened later on that evening so it's pretty scary stuff um it's sad and um, actually this morning they actually showed that one of the guys actually already passed away uh, from the injuries that he received in this shooting okay so um, yeah what I was talking about is um, we're gonna go ahead and try out this app and that is the video that we're gonna be making this week now if you um, are a movie lover like myself i find myself searching a lot through netflix through amazon prime through apple plus um, these are some of the services that i have uh, i do like to watch a lot of uh, a lot of shows you know someone who is interested in filmmaking and making videos for youtube i watch a lot of movies and you know sometimes i even take notes on some of the movies that i watch just because you know, I want to become better. I want to be a better filmmaker. I guess it's kind of just kind of like studying for me, you know, watching all of these movies, you know, seeing how how their story develops, how they use sound design, how they use cuts, how, you know, how the big Hollywood productions do great movies. So recently I've been watching the Marvel comics, uh, the Marvel uh, Universe movies. Now there is a specific sequence that we are watching them on and um, that's kind of what I've been doing lately, recently, but 
I found this app that's called Likewise. So it's basically an app that narrows down your searches. I know if you're anything like me, I spent probably a lot of time just searching for good content. Sometimes I spend so much time that by the time I find something, it's time to go to sleep and I end up not watching it and I watch it the next day. But it takes a long time to, you know, find something good that you are interested in to find in like Netflix or Amazon Prime, for example. So supposedly this app helps you reduce all of that searching by giving you, I guess, suggestions on things that you might like based, I guess, on like a little survey that you do at the beginning uh, when you download the app. So that is exactly what we're going to do this uh, on this video. I'm going to go ahead and start using this app and see how good it is and we're going to watch some of the suggestions that they say and see if they really are good and if they are really curated to a specific you know to you specifically right now what we're going to do is we're going to download the app likewise so this is for movies tv books and podcasts so it's not just for like movies if you're also looking for podcasts or you know tv shows uh or even books, which books is another big thing for me because I've been reading a lot recently. And that has actually been one of my goals. If you uh, haven't seen the video that I made earlier about my goals for 2021, I will link that video right up here and you can check that video out. Okay, so we got it here. It says TV, movies, books, and podcast. Let's go ahead and do books first. Uh, what do you like to read mostly? Let's see. And here are some of the books that it's given me as uh, recommendations. And let's see how many books have I read on this list. So the subtle art of not giving a flying good book. It's actually on my list. Um, seven highly effective uh, people. Good. So Atomic Habits. That's actually a book that I've read uh, before. So it's good that it's on this list. Habits. Habits why we sleep it's also a book that i just recently finished reading actually um not bad the psychology of money i've also heard that's a good book cool this is not a bad selection i think i'm gonna stick with it supposedly this app based on some basic questions that they ask you they give you recommendations based on other movies that you like because they also make you pick movies and stuff like that so based on i guess movies that you like and i guess the type of genres of movies and stuff like that they're going to be giving you some recommendations and this is the one that they recommended us to watch today because did you like fight club and the grand budapest hotel so this week we're gonna be able to watch it in private video. So that is what we're gonna be watching today, and I'll let you know what the movie's about, or I'll let you know if the movie's good. What's up guys? Just uh, a little update about the uh, about the app and uh, kind of what's been going on in that department. So um, a couple of days ago, I downloaded an app that was gonna make my, uh, my movie selection a little bit easier. And um, this is just a little update. So this happened about two days ago. And the very first movie that we were supposed to watch was one called The Cult or just Cult. And uh, according to the phone or to the app, it said that it was on Amazon Prime. Now, when I was uh, looking for it on Amazon Prime, I wasn't able to find it. So I didn't get to watch it. It said that it was on Amazon Prime, uh, but uh, it wasn't there. So I don't know if uh, maybe it was a little bit uh, outdated, at least 
that particular movie. So I didn't get to watch it. So we watched The Avengers instead, which was a great movie, by the way. So then I was like, okay, I'm going to give this app another try. And we tried to... Uh, and we tried basically the second movie that it gave us a recommendation. And this one was from Netflix and it was called The Clovich Killer. Clovich? I think that's how you call it. I think that's how you call it. The Clovich Killer. And this one, it said that it was on Netflix. And yes, it was on Netflix. And we did see that movie last night. And uh, it was really, really good. I mean, at least to me, I don't know about Sabrina. I'm going to get her in here right now. And uh, she can kind of tell y'all what she thought about the movie. Hi. <laughs> so, what did you think about the movie? Um, Clove, Clove Hitch Killer. Mm -hmm. mm. You're not even in the little frame, um, so there you go. There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, did you like it? Clove Hitch Killer. Yeah, it was good. Um, I like the little twist that I had at the towards the end it was good the ending was really good really good um, it wasn't like a scary movie but it was suspenseful yeah not too suspenseful like, just the right amount um, yeah the right amount it did get me on my feet because I don't like I get like nervous or like anxiety <laughs> just wanting to know what's next so that gets me on the edge so that did get me like ah, we can't but overall you liked it mm -hmm. okay good recommendation all right okay. excellent thank you so there you have it folks sabrina approved it she liked the movie she liked some of these recommendations now i'm going to be using this app a little bit longer and maybe i will have a follow-up video um, with more in depth i will maybe even try out some podcasts that it recommends and maybe even some books even though i already have a list of books that i am kind of like waiting to read yeah, that's it, guys. With that said, thank you so much for watching this week's video. I know this was a short one, but uh, if you liked it, please give this video a thumbs up. That really helps out a lot. Subscribe. If you're not subscribed already, make sure you hit and smash the notification bell so you guys can get notified for future videos. And there are more videos coming. Um, it's kind of hard. Um, I know that I'm kind of ranting now and just finish the video, Rick. So um, I'm going to go ahead and leave this here and uh, I'll see you guys next time. So, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, clear out the room, I'm coming through. They want to see what I'm about. Yeah, I got skills, do it for the thrill. I'm on a paper route. Extra, extra, read about it. I'm today's trying to tap it. I put commas over bullshit. Yeah, I put that on mamas. They trying to block all my blessings. They thought I lost a stepping. I bet on me and my team.